All right, hello there, and welcome to another Starfield video. So today we're taking a look at the Nuka-Cola Fuel for the Final Frontier by Cypher. So this adds Nuka-Cola into the world of Starfield. Nine unique and tasty flavors. Um, checking Cypher and anything else. So this costs uh, 100 credits, which is about a euro or about a dollar. And I said in a previous... Um, I'm sorry, I was just reading the description. I said in a, in a previous video, like, I feel like it's 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 like a, a cheat code and not in, a, not in a negative way. When you kind of, like, make mods and kind of price them low at that price, because, like, at a dollar or a euro or, like, 80 pence, like, it's kind of hard to say no unless it's something either you really don't like or something really, you know. And this, I mean, this is an interesting one. So, it will, uh, we'll go and we'll check it out, um... And uh, yeah, I suppose let's let's just get into it, shall we? All right, so we have spawned them in. Uh, we've got nine items, which we're going to check out. Now, one thing I will say, uh, first of all, is usually I'm not a huge fan of like when when someone kind of puts in something from a different universe. But like, I think Nuka Cola, like it's it's kind of like it's cool. You know, I I think it's a cool idea because it's Fallout. Um, so yeah, so we've got the Nuka Cherry, which uh, Nuka Cola with a bold cherry flavor that comes with a sweet refreshing kick, stores three health and eighty percent recovery. We've got standard Nuka Cola. We've got Nuka Cola Dark, which um, Nuka Cola with a rich spice rum flavor and smooth kick, gives plus seventy five damage resistance and minus ten oxygen. We've got Nuka Cola Orange, refreshing classic taste of Nuka, tangy new, refreshing classic taste of Nuka, tangy new taste. Okay, uh, restores three health, eighteen percent O2. Nuka Cola Quantum restores ten health, um, plus twenty five O2 recovery for three minutes. Nuka Cola's newest recipe with eighteen added flavors. Um. We have Nuka Quartz, clear, refreshing Nuka Cola with bright, crisp taste, restores 10 health as well, plus 25 oxygen. Nuka Cola Victory, takes a victory, um, and health and 25 again. Nuka Cola Wild, which Nuka Cola with a bold, zesty flavor and a rugged adventures kick. Uh, three health, aiding recovery. Nuka Grape, uh, grape taste. So, I think one of the things I will say straight away is. I kind of wish, like, I know it's it's priced at a dollar, and, you know, but I kind of wish the mod author put a little bit more uh, thought and effort into, like, the stats of them. Like, if you really quickly go look at, like, the stats in, in, um, in Fallout, they give you different things. Like, it seems like the mod author did put a little bit, because obviously we've got, these ones are just your generic drinks that give, you know, the three health. The dark is based on an alcohol, I'm assuming a whiskey. The Quantum giving 10 health and the Quartz and the Victory giving 10 health is a bit bit strange. Because Quantum in... I mean, Quantum is more powerful than Stimpak in Fallout. Um, given the... Yeah, I kind of feel like that it should restore... Like, Quantum should act more like a... Um, like, I don't know. what What is my health, actually? Because I know that health can be a bit tricky because of your level. What is, I was like 3,000. So, like... Maybe, like, make it so that the quantum, like, restores, like, like, 500, um, 500 health. Uh, the quartz, I'm gonna really quickly, actually, I'm gonna go check, I'm gonna go check the, the wiki, and I'll be right back. Alright, so I am back, so I was just checking, so yeah, so Nuka Dark on, in, because it's been a while since I played Fallout. In Fallout 4, it gives one strength, one endurance, minus one perception. So Nuka Dark, I mean, it'd be cool if it, like, giving one strength and one endurance... You could basically the damage resistance is cool uh that makes sense and then maybe carry weight would be quite cool so nuka cola orange in fallout 76 or fallout 4 gives radiation resistance so maybe you could set it so that it just gives like resistance quantum gives 400 health which makes sense uh quartz the fuck does quartz give that's quartz is zero. Oh, quartz is action points so you could give it the quartz gives uh, oxygen. I don't know if there is actually like, if you can actually give oxygen stat, but it'd be kind of like if quartz basically just because quartz is supposed to give you action points, which is AP. 
But if you could set it so the quartz gave oxygen instead, if that is possible. Um, and then what did, what did, what did Nuka Victory? I know Nuka Victory is like one of the more powerful ones. There's a load of these. I don't really remember what they're from. I'm trying to see what are some of the other ones because we got we got Nuka Cola Wild. He's existing in game. All right, so Nuka Cola Wild. Okay, so Nuka Cola Wild gives a hit points, radiation action points, so you could make it give again like. I think the base one should give a little bit more health or uh, restore a little bit more health just because, you know, this is Nuka Victory. Uh, I think Nuka Victory was like really good, wasn't it? It was like on par, on par with, um, yeah, Nuka Cola Victory gave more hit points than Nuka Quantum. So again, this is just a suggestion because the thing is like, it, it, it's cool that they've added these into the game. I'm going to actually drop them real quick to see what they look like to make sure they have models. Okay, perfect. They do. Uh, one. And I just like kind of like as if we were going to display them. But yeah, like they, they look really cool. The models are like awesome. And like the thing is, it's only a, it's only 100 points. So you know, but it, I feel like it would have been nice just to have that extra, you know, the extra features with it. Just to kind of make it feel more in line and kind of make them more, you know, valuable. Like, they they get added to the loot pool, so we're going to we'll really quickly check in a minute just to see if I can find them in some of the various locations. Now, just keep in mind, when you download this, you will probably have to do a vendor refresh probably a few times. So one of the best places I like to go would be, um, well, actually, oh, one look. What is that one? Oh, is that Nuka Cola Quantum? Oh, no, Nuka Quartz. Uh, I'm just, yeah, I'm only, I'm just moving these around just so you can kind of get a good view of them. If you were going to say, for instance, I feel like a lot of people will probably buy these to display. Um, one thing I would say, which again, see, see, here's the thing. I'm making suggestions, but ultimately, you know, when it comes down to this, it's just an opinion piece. The mod author, I don't know how much work the mod author put into it. They could have spent, like, fucking, like, days or even not weeks, like, you know, like, kind of making these, importing the files, making sure everything lines up. But aside from, obviously, you know, being able to have unique buffs, it would be kind of cool if you could potentially craft them. Like, imagine if, like, the base version, um, like, because that's, that's how you do it in Fallout. You get the base version of Nuka-Cola, and then you could combine it, like you could combine Nuka Cola Dark or something. Um, but yeah, no, aside from that, like it's awesome. It is awesome. And I don't, again, I don't know how. I, I'm not a modder. I don't know how easy or hard it would be to make them have like this different stats. I don't think. Some of them I don't think it'd be too hard. Like making it so Nuka Cola Quantum. Uh, like gives 400 health probably wouldn't be that hard but like some of the other ones like say for instance giving oxygen i don't know if that's an actual thing you could um but yeah it's just a suggestion because like i think the mod itself is awesome all right so we're gonna really quickly go and we're gonna see if we can find these in the vendor selection but we'll be right back. all right so i just basically waited um and i came to cj's and he is selling a singular nuka cola he's selling a Nucola Wild uh, for 50 credits. Now I obviously have perks that decrease the price. So I'm assuming for stopping in. the thing is the mod itself says that Always it gets added to the loot pool as well as like the vendor pool. Now I'm assuming anywhere you can buy food, you can buy them. I did check. I spent a little bit of time checking the uh, the kind of the fancy restaurants um, in New Atlantis. And I couldn't get the spawn. I don't know if that's because the mod author specifically Life chose not to, or if it was just a case of, be, but... um, I was just unlucky. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Like, I think it's a really cool mod, regardless of, like, what I was saying. Like, it's, it's really cool. It's, it's definitely something that, like, obviously, as it, as it's, like, popping up in game and stuff, it'd be really cool. It definitely it would be a lot cooler, um, if the stats were more unique, uh, given that it is a paid mod. 
I'm not saying that it's like obviously as it is it's very cool but yeah and then I think that the other big thing is I think the display option of it is is too because I feel like a lot of there's a lot of outpost builders and kind of ship builders decorators and stuff that will like having that just some cool kind of swag to uh to, to show off yeah that's pretty much it as always guys thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe and catch you in the next one bye bye